Gate 78, 1 Samuel 13 through 16, the Lord rejects Saul as king. 13. Samuel rebukes Saul, Israel without weapons. 14. Jonathan attacks the Philistines, Israel routs the Philistines. Jonathan eats honey, Saul's family. 15. The Lord rejects Saul as king. 16. Samuel anoints David. David in Saul's service. Chapter 15. For King Saul, the question carried life or death importance. He concluded that God would overlook his incomplete obedience because of the general sacrifices he offered, the money he gave to God's service, the time he spent in God's house, the decision cost him his kingdom and eventually his life. Day 79, 1 Samuel 17 through 20, David and Goliath. 17, David and Goliath. 18, Saul's growing fear of David. 19, Saul tries to kill David. 20, David and Jonathan. Chapter 17. The battle is God's battle. If our confidence is purely in the power of God, rather than in any armor or sufficiency of our own, we may be certain that the world's utmost might cannot withstand. God resists the proud and pours contempt upon those who bid defiance to his people, humiliating them by a defeat with the meanest of instruments. Day 80, 1 Samuel 21 through 24. Saul pursues David. 21, David at Nob and Gath. 22, David at Adullam and Mitzpah. 23, David saves Keilah. Saul pursues David. 24, David spares Saul's life. Chapter 21 through 24. The psalm are sacred songs of worship and praise, written by David and others, as emotional responses to crisis experiences. Some of David's most moving psalms flowed from his pen during Saul's murderous pursuit. For an inside look, read Psalms 34, 52, 54, 57, and 142. Day 81, 1 Samuel 25 through 28. David again spells Saul's life. 25. David, Nabal, and Abigail. 26. David again spells Saul's life. 27. David among the Philistines. 28. Saul and the medium at Endor. Chapter 26. What thought must David be wrestling with? Hatred for his mistreatment? Pity for the demented king? Exhilaration that at last his moment of revenge has come? No, there is no hint of animosity or vengeance. Rather, David's only desire is that Saul spares his life until God fulfills his promise. Day 82 1 Samuel 29 through 31. Saul takes his life. 29. Achish sends David back to Ziglap. 30. David destroys the Amalekite. 31. Saul takes his life. Chapter 29. God's providence orders wisely and graciously for his children, even when they have sadly erred. Even the ill favor of man may turn out to be for our good, that our door might be opened for deliverance out of strait our own folly have brought us into. Day 83, 2 Samuel 1 through 3, David's lament for Saul and Jonathan. 1. David learns of Saul's death. David's lament for Saul and Jonathan. 
2. David is made king of Judah. Yushibosheth is made king of Israel. War between Israel and Judah. 3. David's sons. Amnar joins David. Abner is murdered and buried. Chapter 1 Do you love your enemies? If you are still enemies with your enemies, ask God to give you a heart like David's. Then turn your list of least favorite people into a prayer list. It may even turn some of your enemies into friends.